got Shanika Adams from CJOS right now. What up to the East Coast? Shanika, how you doing, my love? I'm doing great. How you doing? Oh, I'm doing so good. I'm doing so good. I, I, I kind of told people that, you know, I proposed to you, so we just have to go along with it, okay? Since it is, you know, my show. <laughs> Definitely. Now, I always wanted to ask you this, but do you think of making a reality show? Yeah, I actually had quite a few offers for some. I can't tell you the names, but yeah, I've had a lot of offers for reality shows. I just have to make sure that it's the right move. And yeah, I kind of want my own show, though. I think it'll be fun and something different for the people to see. So yeah. What are you going to call it? Like, should it, is it going to be like a family rea reality show? Because I was thinking like the Adams Family or something like that, you know? <laughs> well, it could be that, but I would probably call it something like the socialite or the life of oh. you know, something simple. I don't know. I don't know. That's not really my job. I don't really know about stuff like that. I would probably like... <laughs> Shanika Adams on TJOS right now. Okay. So, what got you to start modeling? What got you to start posing for the cameras and, you know, etc.? It's always something that I wanted to do ever since I was young. I'm an attention whore anyway, so <laughs> I love attention. I love to be the center of attention. And I like to do things that get attention, so what better job to do or what better job to be than a model or person that's the center of attention? So, that's kind of where it started. Right on. Do you think do you think you gotten far with, you know, being that attention model and et cetera? Yeah, I definitely think I have. I've accomplished a lot, you know, in my year and a half of doing this, you know, a lot that most people would kill for, you know. So mm -hmm. I'm definitely blessed. And yeah, I think I have. Right, definitely. Shanika Adams on the jail show right now. Okay, so Every model that I interview, you know, some of them are crushing on rappers or actors or, you know, whatever you want to call it. So, is Shanika Adams crushing on a rapper right now or what? I'm crushing on Anderson Cooper. Anderson Cooper. He's on CNN. He's my guy. He's gay, but I love him. <laughs> you see, I, I kind of thought you were going to say J.O., but, you know, <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> Sorry. I'm crushing on you too. I'm crushing on you too. Definitely, definitely. I'm crushing on both of y'all. <laughs> That's the way to do it. That's the way to do it. You know, I'm crushing on somebody myself. So I'm on the phone with her right now, actually. So oh my god! You I think make the listener. <laughs> That's what it is. Okay. So here's a few questions. I mean, I got like several questions from the listeners because they love you. But um, I'm just gonna bring it down to about three. So. Here's uh, Mowgli from Pennsylvania. What up to Pennsylvania? He wants to know. <laughs> he he said he said it in a weird way, but I kind of you know formatted it to my own my own words. He said, uh, "Do you smoke weed?" No, I do not smoke at all. I don't do any type of drugs, but I'll drink with you all day. <laughs> okay, Cassandra from LA. What up to LA? Home. Uh, she wants to know. Uh, what what was your favorite show as a child? My favorite show as a child, hmm, it probably was Hey Arnold. What? My, like my favorite, yeah, like I love that cartoon, and I'm very disappointed that it's not on the air anymore. I'm very disappointed. I thought you were gonna say like all that, or you know, remember all that Good Burger, all that. <laughs> yeah, but I love. I mean, I. I mean, I liked it, but I really loved Hey Arnold, the cartoon. Like, I used to come home every day. I used to come home at 5 o'clock mm -hmm. on the dot. And I used to come home every day when I was in elementary and middle school to watch it. And then they just stopped playing it. All these new cartoons are just black to me. I used to like it too until my uncle, he he told me something I did kind of seem right. He said it was kind of racist because the black dude, what's his name, Gerald? Something like that? He yeah, had, he had the Gerald. He had the fro. <laughs> yeah. So. Oh my god, I don't even, come on now, I ain't even think that deep into it. <laughs> <laughs> Shanika Adams on the jail show right now, only on freshandfamous.com. Okay, and here's Jordan from Compton. Jordan, what up to Compton? Jordan wants to know, uh, you were a trending topic for being on World Star a few months back. What was on your mind when you found that out? That you were on, that you the were on. Thing, uh, go ahead. Well, the first thing that popped into my head was... Damn, homie played me like that. Mm. Wow. <laughs> like, seriously, that's what I thought. And then it was kind of like, you know, 
damn, you know, he beat me to the punch. If I was to release a video of myself, it definitely wouldn't have been that one. Because that was a bit personal. Right. And of course, I wasn't shaving. And that was the reason why I was the training topic because of my hairy cooch. And no, for all the people that are listening and want to know, I do not walk around with a hairy cooch. Okay. <laughs> it was the reason why it was like in this video, but I'm not going to go into detail. But initially, I was, you know, I was hurt at first yeah. a little bit. Because, you know, I got a younger sister and a brother. And, you know, I was, they was having issues at school and things like that. But, you know, it definitely was a lesson learned. You know, I made a mistake. I trusted someone. I thought I could trust someone. And, you know, that's what happens when you trust the wrong people. So I tell girls all the time, and my sister and my brother, you know, you just got to be careful who you trust. Yeah. Who you put your trust into. Therefore, they won't do things like this to you. And you have to be careful with some of the things that you do when you're young. Yeah. You know, I was 18. I didn't think, you know, five years from now, I would be the shitty Adams that I am today. And I didn't think it would matter, but... Obviously, it does, and that's what happens. But, hey, I'm not mad. I'm just keeping it moving. Definitely. Now, what's what's going on with World Star? I mean, now it's like a porn set. At first, it used to be like, you know, people falling down, and it was funny, and interviews. Now it's just like total porn right now. What's going on with that? It's just like, it's really, you know, I, I used to be excited to check World Star every day. Like, I used to wake up, and that would be the site that I would check first to be mm -hmm. honest with you because it was just always something exciting they always had the new hot videos funny stuff like everything but now it's just you know I'm not down in nobody because I have made a world star video myself but it wasn't as graphic as the ones that are on there now yeah and things like that and then they, they just post some of the most outrageous things like a bunch of sexually explicit like it's it's just gotten out of control mm -hmm. And I think they need to tame it before it just becomes another fight. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's crazy. But we're loving you over here, Shanika, anyways, when, no matter what's going on. Of course I am. Aw. Definitely. Thank so, <laughs> all right, so that's all the questions that we got. So just let us know, where can we hit you up at? All the people who are just discovering you and everything, where can we hit you up at to keep in touch with you and, you know, hit you up every once in a while? Well, y'all can definitely hit me up on my Twitter. That's twitter.com backslash Shanika underscore Adams. Or you can always turn to Google. Definitely. Shanika Adams, you've seen her everywhere on the JL show. Now she's mine. So you can't cheat on me with another radio host, all right? Hey, what's up? This is your girl, Shanika Adams, and I love me from Jay. <laughs> love you, too. Have a good one, okay? Jay, yeah. It's your girl Canary Diamonds, Blanca Lopez. Jackson, throw the big deal, Monica Danger, Danny Torres. Man, it's your boy Freddie Gibbs. Your boy sister. You already know who it is. It's Flo, aka AO Flo. Yeah, sir. Why we in C3IT? Now you and my because you not me. Yeah, it's the boy Short, you know what I'm saying? H-Time represents. Yeah, you're always the man. It's Jimmy Valentine. Drummer. You know what that is? Mark Henry. I'm on Fresh and Famous Radio. You listening to me live right here on Fresh and Famous Radio. I'm rocking with Fresh and Famous Radio. J-O and Fresh. Fresh and Famous Radio. Fresh and Famous Radio. Fresh and Famous Radio. Fresh and Famous Radio. I love you, Jay. I love you, Jay. Fresh and Famous Radio. Fresh and Famous, y'all already know what it is. Fresh and Famous, man. Get what did it get lost? And I love you, Jay. I love you, Jay. And I love Jay. Fresh and Famous Radio, man. Fresh and Famous Radio, all that. Fresh and Famous Radio. Shout out to Fresh and Famous, all time for good community. Shout out to my dog, Jill. Fresh and Famous Radio. Fresh and Famous Radio. Holla back at your boy. Southern Flames, good. Fresh and Famous Radio. You know what I'm saying? Fresh music, young money. Yeah, nigga. Fresh and Famous Radio. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in tonight. I love you so much. And if you love tonight's show, donate funds and keep us going on freshandfamous.com. You'll see the donate button on the home screen. What up to Big Fody, Trev, Des Laws, and Shanika Adams for showing love tonight. Follow me on twitter.com backslash radio host J-O. That's radio host J-A-Y-O. And, you know, tell a friend to support the JL show every Sundays, 8 to 9 p.m. West Coast time on freshandfamous.com. It's almost 9 p.m. in Los Angeles. I still have to watch Entourage. Anything you missed will be here for will be here for you tomorrow. So just visit my website. I'm your host Jo. Love you and have a good night.